Why did you choose the field of reproductive medicine? I enjoyed working with couples closely in through this journey and building their families. I found it to be fascinating. That was number one. Number two was just the technology was always evolving, always exciting. There's always something new to learn. Um, and it's just fascinating to me. And so I feel like I am a professional student. I get to keep learning new things, new technologies, and have these wonderful, rewarding outcomes. What do you love most about your job? The thing I love most about my job is realizing or being part of this journey with a couple to achieve their dream of starting or having a family. I find it can be a long journey. I tell them um, it's a marathon, not a sprint, but when we get to the finish line, it is so incredibly rewarding. How do you ensure you have a positive and successful doctor-patient relationship? My goals um, with the doctor-patient relationship are Number one, to listen, be, in, be a good listener, and also communicate clearly. These are difficult you know, technologies we're talking about, and I think communicating clearly is, is very important. And so those two things together, I think, help me build this doctor-patient relationship well. Also, I like to really involve the couple in the treatment plan, empower them um, to help me make our treatment plan so we can plot out where we're going. What would patients who have worked with you in the past say is your best attribute? I think patients who've worked with me would say my best attribute is probably ability to communicate clearly. Also, I can relate well to them. A lot of these women are in a similar stage of life as me. I know what it's like to be a, a woman who's maybe delayed childbearing a little while for career and other reasons, and then you know feel the pressure to try to start a family. Describe a moment as a doctor that you're especially proud of. I recently worked with a couple who had several very negative pregnancy outcomes, multiple miscarriages and even a stillbirth, and it was devastating. We found out through investigation that they both carried the same rare genetic defect that caused these issues. So through in vitro fertilization and genetic testing of embryos, we were able to transfer a healthy embryo, and she recently delivered a healthy baby girl, and they are overjoyed. Outside of work, what's one of your passions or interests? My number one passion outside of work is my family. I have two little girls, um, I have a husband, and so being you know, a wife and a mom are, to me, some of the best things out there. So that's job number two.